Hi, I'm Justin Witte, and I am a curator here at the Cleve Carney Museum of Art. <laughs> and me and my team are busy working on Warhol. And as we know, a big part of Warhol is the Warhol Portfolios a Life and Pop exhibition that's been loaned to us by Bank of America. And that will actually be exhibited here in the galleries in the museum. Um, and I just want to walk you through some of the things we've been doing to prepare for that installation. So this is the way you'll uh, come in when you visit our show. And this first room is going to show a very distinctive body work. I wonder if you can guess what that might be. No, it's not an homage to the Polish national flag, although that would be very honorable indeed. Um, and then we'll move in. And as you can see, although we've, we've done a lot of work to expand our space, we still had to build a lot of walls to make room for the 94 works that will be on loan from Bank of America. So I had the idea to put in kind of an angled wall system to make the most of the space. And as you can see, it really divides up um, the museum space in a dynamic and really interesting way and it allows for the creation of kind of different gallery rooms. Obviously here, we have an homage to the Silver Factory. This will have works on here. We'll have a wonderful Maryland over on this wall. And I'm wondering if you look through the works that we'll have, if you can guess, again, what's going to be displayed on this beautiful ombre wall we have put in. So we come on, you kind of get a sneak peek of uh, another gallery space. We wanted to have a lot of different design walls that really refer to different bodies of work we'll have on display, but also ones that break up the space in kind of a fun, interesting way. Because Andy's work is so colorful, and so much of it um, has a lot going on and is actually playful, we wanted to reflect that in the space and not just have a totally somber white box. So that's why we have the wallpaper here and the different painting treatments. Um, and I really love how these turn out. You can see we start to lay out the position. The reason we lay out beforehand is in case there's any issues that maybe there was a mismeasurement in the early planning that we had for a model where pieces maybe didn't work or maybe things in the space look a little different. We like to put up mock-ups of the work size. So this room's going to have a lot of portraits in it from the Myths, Myths series as well as from his uh, collection of prints he did for the Jewish Museum. Uh, Jews of the 20th century, which will be on this beautiful back wall. That pink is called Razzle Dazzle, in case you're interested, uh, for your home interior design reference. We'll have portraits of Muhammad Ali here from Warhol's Athlete series. And then we kind of circle back to that room where we just were. Again, we see this great wallpaper. Along this wall, we're going to have the wonderful endangered species work. We have display tables coming in that are going to have original copies of The Velvet Underground, their original album, as well as early editions of Interview Magazine that Andy Warhol worked on. Uh, we will have his great work of uh, pieces, space food, also Vesuvius works, and photos by Mabel Forbes of uh, Warhol as well. So as you can see in this space, we're really getting ready to bring in all this work and it's going to be a really fun, engaging, and a dynamic presentation. So, can't wait to see you.